PH the All Rise hit makers are diversifying their talents but want to take it a stage further next year. Anthony Costa told me, I wouldn't rule out a musical, we've been around a long long time now so, we have the songs. There's possibilities for anything to happen with Blue. We are continuing to evolve and move with the times, that's just the way we are as a band. Next year we tour with Steps then into the studio again so we are quite multifaceted. The quartet had a giggle rechristening themselves green for a new cream joy inducing TV mockumentary promoting NPOWER's Go Green Tariff. It was so much fun, they want to continue and make a blue sitcom in the vein of The Office. Duncan, James told me, I'm hoping people will react to it and we can carry it on. Like The Office. We have an actor pretending to be Anthony's Greek uncle and he becomes our manager and rebrands us green. There's a TV show in it. Art imitates life as the lads will actually be performing a gig as Green at Proud Camden on December 11th. Will the next step be a show in Las Vegas like Backstreet Boys? I think we're more Blackpool than Vegas, giggled Anthony, who is threatening to change his name to Jonas Green after fans noticed a similarity with EDM star Jonas Blue. Duncan, Hollyoaks, and Lee Ryan, EastEnders, have second careers in UK soap operas now too, but their bosses don't trust them with the scripts. Duncan explained, we aren't allowed to talk about it, they are all under embargo so they don't even tell us anything in case it gets out. The most important part of these shows is to keep your mouth shut. Visit NPOWER's Facebook and to win tickets to a special one-off gig by Blue. I mean Green. Go to NPOWER.com to find out more about how you can go green with NPOWER this winter. JM International Drake's protege Georgia Smith has won the first Brit Award of 2018, after being named winner of the Critics' Choice Gong. After fighting off tough competition from fellow nominees Mabel and Steph Landon, the breakthrough star will collect her prize at the Brit nominations launch on January 13. Previous winners include stars Adele. Sam Smith and James Bay. She gushed, I cannot believe it, it's been an unforgettable 2017 during which I fully led so many of my dreams and this is such a special way to end the year. The Brit Awards will air on Wednesday, February 21st, live on ITV from London's O2 Arena. Tickets on sale, December 2nd. Dua Lipa's Hots Pictures Dua Lipa The Hot Songstress Pictures Girl of the Moment Dua Lipa Stole, The Show During Poptopia The New Rules Songstress was the pop star everyone wanted to hang out with backstage. Dua was spotted, dancing with Fifth Harmony, catching up with Khalid and hanging out with Niall Horan, who snuck into the crowd to sing along to her performance. Here, here. Phil Magic disorganized Emily Sen has lost hundreds of songs after misplacing phones with vital notes on them. The starlight singer admits her forgetful nature has cost her several albums worth of material. Emily confessed. 
Every time I lose a phone and get a new one I say to myself, this time I'm going to name every file, date it, state which producer I was working with, and so on. And despite being 30, Emily's mum can't stand her swearing on a pop INFL when's track kingdom coming, I did try to use different words but it just didn't work. But we accept that no effect doesn't have the same effect. Why image the Rowling, Stones are back in the studio after their no filter European tour. Mick Jagger confirmed the band are working on a follow-up to last year's cover album Blue and Lonesome, by posting a snap-on, with the caption, Back in the Studio. The Rockers are working on their first LP full of original material since they released A Bigger Bang, more than 12 years ago. Fear's Fifth Harmony are about to take a break are growing as Lauren Uregui reveals, they are ALL exploring their own projects. She admitted the girls are enjoying branching out from the group with solo endeavors. Lauren spilled, we're branching out to creatively discover ourselves, because we never really got an opportunity to do that since we started this when we were. I was like 16 when I started. Her latest solo single is a collab with Steve Aoki, All Night Rock and Roll Rag and Bone. Man spent the money from his hit album to buy a flashy set of knives. The human singer admitted to splashing his cash on less than exciting kitchen utensils. He said, people, think all musicians are millionaires but, even if you are successful, you don't get to see that money, for a long time eve. Been able to treat myself. I bought a nice set of kitchen knives and saucepans. Don't go too mad. Several have attempted to break the internet but after her duet, with Ed Sheeran over the weekend, Taylor Swift unwittingly has. Following her performance at Poptopia in California, where she brought out Ed for their song and game, the superstar has become the subject of thousands of memes. Someone asked to name a batter BH than Taylor Swift and the internet has erupted with hilariously, witty responses. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.